Hello everybody, Pre-Video Universal here. I just wanted to say a couple things before this video starts. Sorry for another one of these intros again, I just be forgetting to say things. So first thing I want to talk about, sorry I didn't post on Halloween. I was going to post an Animal Crossing island tour and then I went to go record it and then I realized I don't know how to use my capture card. I've done it once before, I cannot for the life of me remember. I think it might require another piece that I don't have or don't know where it's at. The struggle is real. By the way, if any of you know how to use a Paseo capture card, Please tell me how to use it. I can't figure it out. I'm dying inside. I spent 16 hours on that island redesigned and I'm struggling, okay? Second thing is, I will no longer be Nerdiversal. I will now be going by Lumilani if you guys have seen the channel name already. So this video will actually be the last video that I introduced myself as Nerdiversal in. I don't know. I just, I came up with the name Nerdiversal when I was like 18 and I feel like at my grown 22 age, I think it's time that I change it to a username that really fits me. Illumilani. I like creepy stuff, okay? And I have gotten the advice from a friend that I should keep doing creepy stuff because I really like doing it and I think you guys really like it. So without further ado, I hope you guys don't mind the username change. I hope you guys watch the Animal Crossing video whenever that comes out and I hope you guys enjoy the video. See ya! Hello everybody! Welcome back to another Nerdiversal Halloween video. So as I stated in the last Alice video, I was just gonna split it up into two pieces um, that part of the game is really fucking long. It's so long. This game is so long. So I'm splitting that domain up into two parts because it is so long. There's the middle piece. Uh, there's an end piece and there's an after piece for that. So without further ado, I guess let's just get into it. Yeah, there's not really explaining to be done. All right. So if you guys don't remember from the last part, we went through the level. Um, so we're trying to find the Hatter's body parts. So we're about to go to the next part to find more body parts. Goddamn. Okay. That was unnecessary. Just let me place a bomb down, then didn't let me walk. Oh, hey, another memory. Okay, let me go get that real quick. It's been years now, Alice. Time to put away childish things. That's the same memory I got earlier. What the fuck? Okay, let's go to the T level. I hate this fucking level. Let's <laughs> just try to get through it. Also, I think his voice is more annoying than the rabbit's was. What's this the same guy? Alright, you cryptic motherfucker. This is actually just what the inside of an Amazon facility looks like. These bombs are about to get used the fuck up. Alright, what's that thing Deadpool says before he goes and he starts fighting maximum effort that's what i feel like right now that camera angle though how why was he already locked onto me oh, god i love the bombs seth if you're watching this thank you for teaching me about bombs i really appreciate that wow oh my god that always took so long with gas laid on alice we'll go to the bright room what we save on beeswax candles and oil See, I get the feeling that he thought he was gonna save money. He just paid with his life. Wow, wow so deep. Yes, game, you're so right. I would like to look at these. Yup, that sure is good game design. I think we wanna go down here. Yes, yes, perfect, okay. Alright. Whenever you guys play games like this, or like, watch media in general, you ever just like, what's the motive behind these things trying to kill me? Who is making them kill? Or do they just have a natural bloodlust? Ah, goddamn. Split the lever to cool the metal. Word? Did you just destroy my bomb? Fucking excuse you, okay, Mr. Too Good for projectiles and explosives. Yeah! Do I just get that one from right here? I think I do. Yeah, okay. Well, I need those roses, though. I need those- I need the teeth. Shit, I don't know if I can get up there. I love how every second this level is just like, please look at me. Please. We made a cool thing and we want you to see it so bad. And you know what? I respect that. Don't kill me. Don't kill me. Don't kill me. Oh. I was just supposed to go around and kill it to get the teeth. Whoopsie. Yes, snow globe. Do your magic. Who? You. You're too weak. Just face it. Come on. Go get your little bomb. 
Go get your little bomb. I have things to open. Come on, mommy has tasks to take care of. All right, what is next? I hear that pig. Let's get the pig. I feel as though it is hidden in some dark recesses. See, I hear it right there. Aha, there you are. I think I even looked in here too earlier and I didn't even notice. Just for a fucking bottle. God damn it. Okay, let's uh let's upgrade a weapon real quick. Pepper grinder. Yeah. Yeah, you know what? I've been using the pepper grinder a lot actually. So let's just go ahead and use that. Cool. And that is almost fully upgraded. I'm very happy about. It. Hello? Okay, Every yeah, that works. Answer. Don't curse the darkness or the cold when you're in the library at night. That is so true. I think I might have already missed some Radula rooms now that I think about it, because we kind of sped through this. If you guys want, when I finish this game, I'll go through chapter select, and then we can all find the Radula rooms together. Hello? Can I shoot it? You cannot shoot it. Then what is it even there for? There you are. That's what that's there for. Okay. Out of curiosity, now that you guys have seen this video game, and I'm assuming you've also seen some Alice content, like let's say the original Alice in Wonderland, and then Tim Burton's. If you guys have seen Tim Burton's, what's your favorite cat design? I think mine is the one from the Tim Burton's Alice, just cause it's like fluffy and cute, but also a little bit creepy. And this one is cool. I don't know. He's just, he's kind of sickly. Like he's definitely cool. Cool as hell, but I don't think he's my favorite. This your cat has nine lives, Alice. I hope you have as many. Well, I am the protagonist. I have as many lives as I want to have. Oh, 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 <laughs> combo! Here we go, all right. Presence here is unwelcome. We have a mission to complete, and you are an intolerable annoyance. Well, so are you. But no one likes it this hard. <laughs> oh, I didn't look before I jumped. Oh, shit, oh, oh. <laughs> I'm kind of just praying to survive at this point, and then like, hoping wherever I go is the right way. Oh, well that was the right way, just not the right time. Didn't even give him a chance to spawn. I've got the arms you need. Well, strictly speaking, the hatter needs them. Well, it really doesn't matter. <laughs> I'm going to cross you. Okay, let's go, let's go, let's go. Oh, I already cooled it down. Okay, cool. Okay, bolter flies. All right. Let me hit this first. Oh, no, guess not. Yeah, I guess it would be smarter to just kill the ball. Okay, now. There we go. Oh, I love having a fully upgraded gun. There's so much space in it. I've actually kind of grown to hate the bottles. It's like, they're not memories. I, I don't care about this. You don't know I have small abilities. I hate the way they sound. That's kind of fucking freaky. Okay, come on, come on, come on, come on. That just killed him instantly. There wasn't even a point. Shit. Good. Ah ha ha, yeah. You'd think they would learn after the first time. They don't. Oh, thank God that spawned right there. I would not have lived. Where? Where? I heard them, but I don't see them. Are they in the room, the next room? Yes, they are. Aw, look at he lit up his little bat cannons. How cute. A temporary setback, a minor hindrance, a trivial impediment. <laughs> I'll just move along. I'll deal with you later, Alice. You'll never stop our grand plan. <laughs> Suspicious. Okay. He left faster than the rabbit did, I think. Oh, dude, it's so hot in here. Why is it hot in the beginning of October? I hate global warming. And there's your arms. Okay, that's all of Hatter's pieces. Let's go dump down that chute and then proceed to the next part. And we're gone. Yeah, they should have gave him more chair. That would have been fun and exciting.
Oh, but he does have his funky hat, though. He does have his funky hat, I've though. Finished my work and you're complete, Tata. Now, what about this damnable train? That was cool. I feel like a new man, or whatever I am. I feel like an unsprung spring, like an uncorroded gear, like an untarnished bit of metal that sticks in your eye. Oh. Answer me, Hatter. I'm suffering, and changes here are a cause, or they're a reflection, or the effect. What's going on? What are the new rules? The law is just, just a whisper away, away home to wonder, wonder who. Who knows how to measure rules with a ruler? Cruel rules. Mm. Idiot. I should have <laughs> you in bits. Come. The least you can do is help me discover what's going on. I'm surprised he's actually kind of helping. Whatever. I'll take it. And we're off. Okay, so this part is where I think it's super tedious. Like, there's just so much to do for so little reward. It just kind of didn't need to happen. We could have had a short little walkthrough sequence and I think I would have been happy. Papa, your enthusiasm for photography makes the library smell like rotted fruit. You certainly solutions are toxic. So right now it's kind of just trying to say like, it was the family that kind of set themselves up for the fire. Not like set them up per se, but like they were definitely more vulnerable because of all of the shit that they had in that damn house. These cockpits will be our macadam, our road into assemblage. Hurry, jealous, I'll get this door open. Okay, this part is tedious, but it is pretty cool, I will say. Doesn't seem to really be hurting them though. Like just exploding it on them doesn't seem to be taking any of their life. I guess I just gotta do it more times. But like then I would just use my sword. There's no point. Oh maybe this guy. This guy probably. Well that didn't work. Yeah that didn't really work. Yeah that upgrade on my on my pepper grinder is kind of killing it right now. Whoever said there is no book so bad but something good may be found in it never read Martin Farquhar Tupper's proverbial philosophy. I don't know what that is. You know what, editor me, you should look that up and then uh, put in captions what she means by that. This feels like an earthquake. What's happening? Do I really look like I know? Your judgment must be severely impaired. Cool. I fit through there. That's me sized. That is so fucking suspicious. Anything else in this room that I need? No? No? Okay. Alright, I'm gone. Just the way she just falls so flatly. Bro, I'm trying. I don't see you messing with inner mechanisms and shit. Kinda just looks like you're standing there, actually. Never mind, I take it back. You're so cool, Mad Hatter. You're so actually not useless. Holy shit. That is so fucking cool though. Like that's such a cool fucking design. For a train? Please. Oh my god. Look at I it. I found the source of the shaking, but are those two quaking? What are they up to? You'll never stop us, silly Hatter and Alice. It's left. You're too the late. Insolence, <laughs> the arrogance, the execrable table manners. They are destroyers of Wonderland. Defilers, denuders, derangers. Delightful. It's present. Did they actually create <laughs> that infernal train to destroy Wonderland? What does that matter? They deserve to die. Ah, put me down. Enough talk. Damn, time that missing. gear kind of messed him up. Boss battle time! Let's go, let's go, let's go. Abandon false hope. Forget the past. The damage is done. <laughs> Let the madness begin. Resume the folly. Ah. 
So yeah, when I first played this part, I was shitting my pants when I saw that thing come up above. Um, and then it fell apart. And suddenly my life was okay, and I was cured of every mental disorder I could ever have. Precious to me, and the guests. All I really wanted was another tea party. Aw. Please, Hatta, you promised. Where is that train going? See, he's saying that, but they were dismembered in the last game. Now. There's no time for whatever Why would you got to dismember for a tea party? It's time for tea. Talk treats with Turkey. He ran the looking glass line. <clears throat> Come on, you lot. We can still be friends. Drink, drink. <laughs> My memories are shattered. I'm trying to collect the pieces, and I now believe the train impedes me. You must help me. You promised. Ask the one who helps them what helps themselves, whoever that is. Very pick. He deserved to die. And I'm about to drown in tea in ignorance. Damn. So he just died. They both, they all did. I mean, I guess except for Alice, because Alice is, you know, she's just Alice, but. Caught me very own ribbon neck. Ugh. Saints be praised that he works in mysterious ways. You got plans for her. Take her over to the oh. mangled mermaid. Rent a bed. Ew, oh, dude. A girl, Mr. Broad. What do you think you're doing? What comes natural oh. Natural to me. Get away. See, it sucks, too. She's, like, so... Like, she doesn't have all her powers in the real world. Oh, White Cat. There he is. White Cat reminds me of my snowdrop. Nanny knew her. Ah. <sighs> Wonderland is so cool. Wonderland. Sorry. Wait, this isn't Wonderland. London. The London environment is so cool. I like rain in video games. I think it just adds coolness. It's like Minecraft. I like Minecraft with rain. <laughs> I'm gonna go drinking on the job? Whatever. I'm not an arc. Wait, show it to me. The Mangled Mermaid. Pay attention to these little details like this, because, like I said, the elements of Wonderland, or of London, end up in Wonderland. It'll show up again and later in the game, kind of. Part with some rough edges. Likes everything rough, I'll wager. Uh, <laughs> I've got an appointment with another man. Well, girl, how hard do you want to make this? You should know that doctor says I have a terrible disease. Okay, that's- everybody's disgusting here. How about you? Are you disgusting? I can't talk to you, so maybe not. Where's me money, you fucking spank buckets? Get those fat ass whores out on the street or I'll come up and brain Shut you. Shut off, you cocker snipe. You'll never get past long, Tim. I'll get what you and your flutes owe me, Miss Ladybird. See if I don't. Maybe you notice I'm not pissing me drawers at the prospect. Oh shit. Alice. She's so hard for that. You're making nice change. Bring your disheveled self up here. Damn, so she she's the woman who raised me. And it sounds like she's a prostitute now. Wait, this was right. I probably would have been a prostitute if she hadn't helped me, which is kind of insane. Although I don't know exactly what Nurse Whitless has actually done. Once heard Tim say he'd likely die from a social disease. Poor man never dreamed it was the name Jack Splatter. It was a hell of a name, I will say. That's so pleasant. Love how all the guys in this game are- Oh my god, built the same. You won't give me hey! Water. I'll burn this dump of yours down to the ground. Come on, girl. She's done no harm. <laughs> she hurt me feelings. Men. Damn! He could have just pushed her, but he just fucking. Damn. Okay. All right. There. The siren dress is actually in place now. This is how you're supposed to look in this level. I love how last time was super graceful and we like exploded into our dress. This time she literally just comes down like a comet. Okay, so Tundra Fall and everything underneath is going to be another part. Um, but unlike those, those are going to be recorded not today because I've been playing for like four or five hours straight. All right. I hope you guys liked this episode of the Alice Madness Return series and I hope you guys will tune in for the next one. So I will see you guys later. Bye. Yeah.